Hi everyone. Um, you know, as usual, our focus is China and the world. Huh? And uh, in China, in the last uh, two, three months, there's a lot of, the, I would say, dramatic uh, development. For, for three months ago, it was still this very tough, brutal and sometimes cruel lockdown, right? And then suddenly, on the 7th of December, uh, the CCP uh, announced that they uh, suspend all lockdown, no more lockdown, nothing, totally nothing, and no mask, uh, and no uh, social distance, and so on and so on. Just poof, overnight, yeah? Uh, it's very interesting. And what happened is, uh, it was reported by the Chinese official uh, media that a lot of people got infected but only 20 people uh, died of corona. So it's very interesting. Yeah? And, but this is the, what the official information said. But you know, as I remind uh, my friends all the time, uh, we can't trust the, the uh, information from uh, CCP-controlled uh, media. And all Chinese media are CCP-controlled, uh, Communist Party control. So, now, if you look at other uh, media, for example, uh, uh, media such as uh, Radio Free Asia, uh, also I have checked the German one, Deutsche Welle, and also some uh, English one, and also uh, Epoch Times and NTD, all this more, so to say, uh, from seen from CCP, uh, very uh, independent <laughs> newspaper. They, they are not afraid to tell people uh, the truth and, and upset CCP, okay? When you look at this media, then we, we got a totally different picture. The only thing in common is, yes, it's true. Yeah, like the CCP uh, admit, 600 million Chinese yeah, are infected. Actually, this figure is growing. Now they are saying that 800 million are infected. Yeah? And, and, and the difference now come is the number of deaths. Yeah? Uh, of course, uh, if outside China, doesn't matter which media, which independent media, it's difficult to find out the exact number of corona deaths, right? Because it's stay secret, you can't get it. But one thing is for sure, they reported, all these independent media reported, that all the funeral homes were tw working 24 hours and totally full, it's almost impossible to, to get an appointment. And, and, and car, private car, with dead body inside of the loved one in the family, were queuing, long, long queue to get to the funeral homes. So, now, this may be still not enough yeah, to, to believe that it's a huge number of deaths. Yeah? So I call actually my contacts, my friends uh, in China, uh, in different big cities, you know, Shanghai, Beijing, Nanjing, Guangzhou, and so on. Yeah? And they confirm the same situation. It uh, is a little bit, uh, uh, how should I say it, uh, deep, not totally in phase. Yeah? So for example, for, for, for months ago, it was very serious in Nanjing. And now it's not so serious in Nanjing, but very serious in Shanghai. Yeah? Uh, and also for a month ago was terrible in Beijing. A friend of mine who, who before he retired, he was a high ranking uh, CCP official. And he told me, it's so sad that all his friends are passing away. His, his school friends are passing away one after another. Now, uh, you know, he and his uh, um, uh, university friends are more or less of the same age, right? And I know that most of his friends, they are also relatively high-ranking CCP official, and they are passing away one after another. He's very sad, yeah? So, and now, and not only that, that we have a, a tremendous death toll. Now the CCP suddenly opened the border. Yeah, they they almost encourage Chinese people to travel in the whole world. Huh? With eight hundred million infected, corona infected Chinese, 
and, 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 and many suffer from heavy diseases so that it leads led to death. And now they are letting the people to travel the whole world. What is happening? So, dear friends, I, 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 I think, I think what happened is, first, CCP thought that they can make use of Corona, this uh, pandemic, to show the world the so-called superiority of uh, socialism with Chinese characteristics. So, what does that mean? That means, yeah, people should understand, the whole world should see, everywhere if you have big problem with pandemic, yeah, but in China, because of our system, everything is under control. And, and, and the, con the method of control is lockdown, lockdown. If one person gets tested positive, yeah, his whole building will be locked down. And sometimes his, the whole, uh, when it is more than one person, yeah, then the whole district will be locked down, or the whole city. And even a mega city like Shanghai with uh, 26 million people living there, were totally locked down. So they thought they could demonstrate uh, the superiority, the power of dictatorship. That is basically what they did because the lockdown is nothing else but a terrible abuse of human rights. Yeah? No freedom of movement, no freedom of speech. Anyone who disclosed anything about corona may end up in jail or even lose their life. So, and after three years of such brutal and cruel lockdown, and the result is failure, okay? Actually, during the whole lockdown, lockdown time, outbreak of corona was take, took, taking place all the time. If not Wuhan, then it's uh, Beijing. If not Beijing, it's Shanghai. If not Shanghai, it's Guangzhou. You know, it's all the time. They never managed with this so-called zero COVID. Yep, that means through lockdown, they can manage to kill all virus, so that there will be zero COVID virus in China. It's a nonsense, totally nonsense. So after three years, many Chinese got really fed up. So some people are courageous and started with this uh, uh, blank paper revolution. They call it the protest with the white A4 paper, right? <laughs> and, uh, and the method, by the way, for the CCP to stop that is to forbid all the shops to sell white, blank A4 papers. You know, this is a joke, but not a joke. I mean, I mean, what they do is really uh, like a joke. Yeah. So, and uh, and <laughs> and uh, now, now it's interesting. Now they are actually encouraging, in a way, people to travel in the whole world. That means. They failed to, to kill all the virus, and now they let all Chinese people to get infected purposely. There was an internal document from the central government to all the local government, yeah, quickly let all people infected as soon as well we get a kind of a, a, a herd immunity. It's crazy. Three years, they ignore all the science of medicine and, 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 and did not believe in uh, herd uh, 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 immunity. And now suddenly over one night, they want to have it. So make have all Chinese uh, infected and let them to go to the, the whole world. That remind us what happened three years ago. All the infected Chinese went from Wuhan went to the whole world and quickly managed to create a pandemic. Now, ladies and gentlemen, this is, you, you, one have to ask why they do that, you know? Yeah, I think, as I used to say, when you want to be the biggest, the strongest, yeah, among whatever it is, there's always two ways to do it. One way is to make yourself stronger, another way is to make others weaker. So they are doing both, okay? So uh, now, but I think I'm still an optimist. Uh, I think more and more uh, politicians and, and peoples uh, in the Western world, in the democratic world, are waking up. So one typical example is we know that the American Congress has got a new speaker, yeah, McCarthy, instead of uh, Pelosi. And since he became the speaker, a, a series of action has been taken which all target 
CCP. And one of them that makes CCP really frightened, I tell you, and that is they passed a, a, a bill saying that American government uh, has to investigate and find out the origin of corona. You know that for three years ago, Australian government said the same thing. And what happened? China CCP immediately uh, uh, started a sanction against Australia and uh, giving a lot of uh, trouble for Australia. Now this time, America or American Congress say the same thing, do the same thing, but there's no sanction yet <laughs> because America is not Australia. But this is the mentality of CCP, you know. They bully everyone whom they think they are weaker. Yeah? And they dare not to bully those they think are stronger. And luckily, America is still a bit stronger. So they, <laughs> they, they keep silent. So, and also uh, recently, you know, there is a lot, a, a very interesting uh, movement, and that is Japan has been uh, not only making military alliance with America and England, the openly declared that, Japan also talked to France, talked to Germany, talked to, you know, uh, several U European countries to talk about, uh, uh, so to say, uh, common defense against CCP. So, ladies and gentlemen, don't forget to click like and don't forget to check your subscription. That's all for today. See you next time. Bye-bye.